The smoke rolled in a couple of days ago. This is smoke from the Alberta wildfires, which are burning in central and northern Alberta. Crazy sunset. The sun just looks like a ball hanging there. Odd. Lots of smoke. Very strange sunset. It's a trustworthy neighborhood. Just getting the car set up here to be able to go in. So, on the street, do some pylons, be able to create a bit of a block, and Elsie is going to get loaded in their home, head back to BC. So, Curtis, how many sites were left? This one. <laughs> the only one left. And we, and we fit. And we fit. Amazingly. Curtis did an awesome job backing in. It was fantastic. You did a great job navigating. Oh, did everyone hear that? It's that I did it. Woohoo! <laughs> We're at Howard Lake and it is stunning. So, so very, very pretty. We have a great campsite. Wide open. Perfect. Well, we are in Green Lake at Sunset View, Green Lake Provincial Park, and we are in Site 30, which we've stayed here twice last year. Yeah, we're excited to be camping. And woohoo, the sun is kind out. Fingers crossed. Tonight's dinner is pork ribs done over a low fire. Curtis is so excited. He got his Milwaukee cordless chainsaw, um, which is just perfect for what we need. Easy to bring it along with us everywhere without having fuel spilling everywhere. So it's awesome. So Debbie, what happened? it in the water without denting it or losing our truck in the water so <laughs> so so far so good there's a the trailer ready to come up out of the water so looks great in the water are you happy seems pretty nice gotta be louder than that are you happy seems good good Alright Debbie, where are we? We are at Sunset View, Site 17, Green Lake. And what's special about Site 17? <laughs> you have direct lake access. Uh, let's go and take a park about there. Let's go take a look. So did I have to back this in for you? Show you how it's done? I did it all, even the Anderson blocks. Look at you go. So this is Site 17. This is why this is such a special site. It is the prime site at Sunset. You have your own beach access, but you have a place to be able to moor the boat to. It's a beautiful spot. There's the boat there already. And 
we're gonna put our boat right there where that dragonfly is flying. So this is our first boat ride with Luna, whose tongue is hanging outside of her mouth, and Huxley, who thinks this is better than the track. Well, we just completed our first week at Juniper Beach and we are in site number one and we love the site. And yes, that is a train in the background. So we're part packed up, so things aren't quite what they were. And we're moving to site 10, which is a nice site, but it certainly isn't number one with all of this privacy. Steady stream of sockeye by here again this morning. I don't know if you can see that very well, but it is crazy. Let's swim through here. So we unpackaged all of the pieces for the garden shed and there are a lot of pieces here. So we got the mess, but that's the purpose of the garden shed right here. So we're just going to start figuring it out and putting this thing together. It is September 21st, the first day of fall. This morning was all ice. But now the sun is out, it's a clear blue sky and it's beautiful. Typical fall day. So not a bad office desk to work at here. Beautiful blue sky. It's quite warm now. It is a nice way to do some takeoffs. So. Okay, out on the boat here on Lac Lejeune Lake. It's a beautiful lake. We fishing. Only got one bite. Jim was fishing with us. He didn't get any. So no fish night. So Debbie, where are we? We're on the hay ranch. What are you doing? Walking with a very happy dog. It is an absolutely gorgeous fall day. It is. Colors are in the trees. It is beautiful here in the trees. 